couple of minutes ago, I called the United Nations Secretary General, Mr. Kofi Annan, to inform him about our readiness to accept international peacekeeping forces through the United Nations from friendly nations to restore peace and security in East Timor, to protect the people and to implement the results of the direct ballot of the 30th of August, 1999. And continues to be determined by these perilous and goals. At the same time, they have to recognize that there are limits. The Indonesian Defense Forces try to stabilize the situation in East Timor since the declaration of martial law on the 7th September. At the same time, they had to recognize that there are limits to what more they would achieve. They have done their utmost in a very complex and complicated situation under very difficult psychological constraints without neglecting their responsibilities for peace and security in other parts of the Republic of Indonesia. East Timor, after the declaration of martial law, too many people have lost their lives since the beginning of the unrest, lost their homes and security. We cannot wait any longer. We have to stop the suffering and the mourning of immediately.